Hey, I'd like to welcome you to another episode of Money Matters Top Tips for Success, where each and every day I bring on new business owners, entrepreneurs, and executives and have them share their top tips for success with you. My name is Adam Torres. You can follow me on Instagram at Ask Adam Torres to keep up with my book releases, book tour schedule, signings, all that other good stuff. I always love to connect with you there. And as always, if you'd like to apply to become a co-author of one of my upcoming books, just head on over to the website, moneymatterstoptips.com, and click on Become an, Become an Author to Apply. All right, so today I have Caitlin Steinberg on the line, and she's Director of Clinical Operations over at Midwest Express Clinic. Caitlin, welcome to the show. Hey, Adam. Thanks for having me. I'm excited to be here. And we're excited to have you, and I'm excited to hear all about all the great things you're doing over at uh, Midwest Express Clinic to help your patients. Um, but before we do that, let's get a little bit further into your background. So how did you get started in your career? Yeah, sure. So I really do enjoy helping others. I've always wanted to be in the healthcare field, so my background is primarily in nursing. Um, I ended up graduating from University of Illinois in Chicago in 2016 with my degree as a family nurse practitioner. Shortly after, I started working with Midwest Express Clinic. Um, there, I initially was working solely as a nurse practitioner, and then over the past year, I've moved my way up into management and into this director role. Well, first off, congratulations on your rise. I love it. Great stuff there. <laughs> uh, so that's awesome. Um, and let's uh, and, and you're the perfect one to uh, to talk on it. Let's get into uh, what you're doing over at Midwest Express Clinic. So tell us a little bit more about the business, please. Yeah, definitely. So Midwest Express Clinic, we are an urgent care chain that is family owned and operated. Uh, we started in 2012 with our first location being in Munster, Indiana. We currently have 17 locations between Indiana and Illinois, majority of which were purchased within the past year. So we are growing pretty rapidly. Um, our most recent was the takeover of five MedSpring locations in the heart of Chicago. So that was a huge accomplishment for us. Um, you know, right now, urgent cares are huge. Patients' time and money is valuable. They don't want to wait for three hours, spending hundreds of dollars in the mm -hmm. ER, or two weeks, you know, to get into their primary care physician. So that's kind of where we come in. We're open seven days a week, 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. Um, patients can schedule an appointment or they can just walk in when it's convenient for them. Our providers, we see all ages and accept most insurances. I would say um, our main goal is just to get our patients in and out within an hour while still providing quality care at an affordable price. So, Caitlin, I have a funny story for you. I didn't know what an urgent care was until maybe like what? a year ago or two years. No, no joke. So I've never, never got sick, anything like that my whole life. Never broke a bone, nothing. And so I'm, I'm oh, I probably just jinxed myself, Caitlin. Thank you. But <laughs> yeah, you're so I, I, I fell asleep with my contacts in and I had like, and I didn't know what to do. I'm like, oh, I got this eye infection. I need these drops. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I'm calling people. <laughs> I literally called a friend that was a doctor, and I'm like, what do I do? I have to go to the emergency? I don't know. I feel dumb. Like, I'm going to go to the emergency room because I have eye infection. <laughs> so, like, go to right. urgent care. I'm like, what's that? So, I, I believe there's some people out there right now listening that don't know what urgent cares are because I was one of them. Um, so, that being said, I, I just love the ease of you go in, you're in, you're out. Um, talk a little bit more about the service and what makes Midwest Express um, special and unique. Right, yeah. So I think what separates us clinically from a lot of other urgent cares is, you know, we do see those standard ur those standard urgent care patients, such as mm -hmm. acute illnesses, like you were talking about with the eyes or lacerations or injuries. Um, but we also offer primary care services. So for those mm. patients who can't get into their doctor, we can take care of your high blood pressure, your diabetes. Uh, we do general wellness exams with blood work. So, you know, we can do your yearly physical um, the other thing that really wow. stands out is we schedule follow-up appointments. So we like to see our patients back. We want to make sure they're getting better and that they're satisfied with their care. Um, I would say another big thing is we like to reach out to our millennials and try to stay up on trends. So we also offer services such as B12 injections, um, Botox and fillers. We do baby gender reveals and IV hydration therapy, so trying to stay up on the trends as well. Did you say baby gender reveals? What does that even mean? How do you do that? Yes. Tell me. So, so if a woman is pregnant, she can come in and we will do an ultrasound in the office, and we can tell her if she's going to be having a boy or a girl, typically before she goes to her OB doctor. So at about 15 weeks, we can do that for them. 
Oh my gosh, this is cool. You're doing it. <laughs> I, I like it. So I see why Midwest Express um, Clinics is um, why they're doing, um, you know, why you're doing so well, why you're growing so fast. Um, and so what, what are the locations? Like what are the areas that you serve? Because I have a nationwide audience, so I want to make sure that the right people know where to find you. Yeah, definitely. So right now we're, we're mainly in the Midwest, Indiana and Illinois. Um, so we have Crown Point, Indiana, and to the east. And we also have Willowbrook, Illinois, to the west. Um, up north, I would say our furthest location is Skokie, Illinois. And then south is Bourbonnet, Illinois. So we're kind of all around upper Illinois and northwest Indiana. Man, that's exciting. Um, any other announcements or cool things going on over at Midwest Express Clinics or plans for 2020? Um, as of right now, we have actually another location that's going to be opening up in Maryville, Indiana, in February of 2020. So that's our next big thing. And then, yeah, just looking for more locations and hoping to grow even more this next year. We'd like to have, have a goal of about 25 within the next year or so. Man, I can't keep up with you. I'm gonna have, we're gonna have to, I'm gonna have to bring you back in 2021 and say, okay, Caitlin, what are you guys up to? What's the tab? This is like, uh, this is like sports betting. Like, how many, okay, how many edge now? I'm excited. All right, 25 was the goal. What's the over under on that? No, I love it. Um, that's great stuff, Caitlin. <laughs> um, so if somebody's listening to this and they want to learn more about Express, uh, Midwest Express Clinic, um, what's the best way for them to get that information? Yeah, so our website is www.midwestexpressclinic.com. Um, we are also all over social media. So at Midwest Express Clinic, you can find us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, LinkedIn, all of the above. Man, that's awesome. Well, hey, Caitlin, um, really appreciate you coming on the show today and sharing more about your background and all the great work you're doing over at Midwest Express Clinic to help your patients. Um, and to the audience, as always, thank you for tuning in. Hope you got a lot of value out of this. If you did, don't forget to subscribe to the podcast or subscribe to the YouTube channel, Money Matters Top Tips. Um, do all those great things that we do to support our podcasters. I really do appreciate it. And, uh, Caitlin, thanks again for coming on the show. Thank you so much for having me. I really appreciate it.